too made the same decision as mentioned when I joined the Navy right after my 17th birthday. Very young, as you are now. I had no idea then, nor can you really know today, how your decision will be played out in the coming years. The important thing at this point is that you have stepped forward to join the millions of men and women who went before you and who have made America the great country that it is. We need to celebrate the decision that these young men and women are making uh, to, to engage in that most important uh, commitment and public service that there is. Please welcome the director of the Ohio Department of Veteran Services, Major General Deborah Ashenhurst. Thank you. The heroes in this nation are those who take on a life of service to give back. So those heroes, I think of police, fire, other first responders. I think of the teachers who've led you, led you to this place and helped you to attain the goals that you have to be able to enlist. But mostly, I think of those who wear the cloth of our nation, who say, I want to serve. Less than 1% of our population of this incredible nation who stand up and they'll put on the colors of our nation, who will wear the uniform of our nation. You are a very elite group of individuals. You're a member of a team. So when you were told to look left and look right, these are the people you're going to be serving with. You don't do anything alone. Success doesn't come to you. Success comes to your team. Sound off. Who is joining the Army? <laughs> Who is joining the Marines? Hoorah! Hoorah, you're a hua, you're a hoorah. Who is joining the Navy? Hoorah! That was good. <laughs> All right, Air Force, who is joining the Air Force? <laughs> <laughs>